Hey, hey everybody, today we're doing large mouth. I got a couple of them here. Super easy to flay, make good table fare. Anytime you, anytime you get to eating sports fish, you're gonna catch just a little bit of lash back, but I grew up eating these fish. My, my pops absolutely loved to bass fish farm ponds. So I probably ate more large mouth as a kid than I did catfish or crappie. So I'm gonna get you in here real close and show you how to flay these these bass out. All right, I'm pretty sure I got you where you can see. We're just gonna take this electric flay knife and go right behind this fin, kind of angling back up towards the head. We'll cut down to the, the spine, and then we're gonna turn and cut down the spine all the way to the tail. And you just turn and follow that spine down to the tail. Tell you just flip it and follow that skin. Flip them over and do the other side. Kind of angle back up towards the head. Just a second, I'll take them ribs off the belt. There's not no red meat on the back of a bass fillet like there is a catfish or a sand bass. It's a little bit, a little bit firmer than uh, catfish. But it still fries up real nice. And just take your take your knife here, cut these ribs out. Like so. There you go. Boneless, skinless flays here. Wash up real nice. All right, I'll get them in the house and wash them off and show you what they look like. There they are. Like I said, they clean up real nice. There's no red meat to be cut off the back of them. They fry up real good. I think next time we'll try to get some some perch and show you some different ways we clean those 